Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Mike, KD2KOG, part of the technical support staff here at SDRplay.com. We're going to switch this up a little bit. Let me get close this way you guys can see what I'm talking about. All right, we got both loops installed. One is northeast, one is northwest, but we're going to switch this up a little bit because the fun part of this hobby is experimenting. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this loop here that's pointed northwest and I'm going to stack it on top of this loop in a horizontal position, this way it's like this. And when you take a loop that's vertical, because remember I said it's a figure eight pattern. So wherever this is pointed, you want to point it to the signal. If I stack it on top of this loop, it now makes this loop omnidirectional in a figure eight pattern. So I'm going to try that with diversity reception, because for diversity, you need separation. And on HF, you're talking hundreds of feet of separation between the antennas. And using two loops, with, I would say, maybe 10 feet of separation max is not ideal. But everything is run. Uh, we're functional. But I want to step it up. And as I said, the whole point of doing this is to experiment. So next video, this will be, let's see if I can actually pop this off and show you the actual plane. Just bear with me. Okay, we got the loop out. So the loop is going to be, instead of in a vertical position, it's going to be in a horizontal position like this and stacked. I'm not sure yet if I'm going to go on top of it or on the bottom. So I have to go to the hardware store, pick up some PVC fittings and some pipe, and hopefully in the next video we'll have a functioning setup. And I'll see you guys in the next one. So stay tuned. The journey continues.